In my previous videos on keyword research, I showed you one of a few ways I extract keywords from Amazon. But what if you were strapped for time and needed your keywords sooner than later? Then it's high time you look into getting the best keyword research tool. Today, I'm going to share an Amazon keyword research tool in the Keyword Tool Dominator. Get my full Keyword Tool Dominator review today where I'll discuss the pros and cons of this extension. Stick around. Welcome to Self Publishing with Dale and if you want to master DIY publishing then subscribe and turn on your notifications for all my latest videos. What keyword search tool do you use? Have you tried the Keyword Tool Dominator or do you know of any other keyword tool alternative? Let me hear from you in the comments. Earlier this year when I was searching the internet for an inexpensive Amazon keyword research tool, I stumbled by the Keyword Tool Dominator plugin while browsing the internet. The Keyword Dominator tool claims to find long tail keywords your target audience is searching for, but the extension in online software is much more than an Amazon keyword tool. In fact, the full Keyword Dominator tool suite includes access to the Google Autocomplete Keyword Tool, Bing Keyword Tool, eBay Keyword Tool, Google Shopping Keyword Tool, Etsy Keyword Tool, and the YouTube Keyword Tool. It's a super easy interface where you select the keyword research tool for the appropriate platform, search a broad keyword, and then the Keyword Tool Dominator whips together real-time results of long-tail keywords. The unique value proposition that Keyword Tool Dominator offers is a keyword rank. According to KTD, the keyword rank is a value assigned from 1 to 10, ranking the popularity of a keyword based on the position of the keyword suggestion as returned from the autocomplete service. KTD shared in their FAQ that other keyword research plugins and extensions measure the value of a keyword through search volume. However, they further express, be very suspicious of keyword tools that offer search volume data for other services like Amazon, eBay, and Etsy, as this information is not publicly available and is only obtained if an advertising campaign is ran for a given keyword using the highest bid for an entire month. The Keyword Tool Dominator offers free access to a few keyword searches per day, or you can upgrade to the $50 Amazon Keyword Tool. To get even more bang for your buck, you can buy the entire suite for $100. For the sake of focusing on how this keyword research tool benefits your self-publishing business, we'll zero in on the Amazon Keyword Research Tool in KTD. The $50 Amazon Keyword Tool purchase includes unlimited real-time keyword suggestions, unlimited daily searches, unlimited keyword downloads, keyword ranking by popularity, niche and long tail keywords, multiple international versions supported, lifetime updates, and no monthly subscriptions or additional fees. And now for the pros and cons of the Keyword Tool Dominator. The pros of the Keyword Tool Dominator include, one, inexpensive lifetime access. I've used a handful of other keyword research tools and this price point by far is the best. Barring any drastic changes in the KTD headquarters, I'll be enjoying a life of easier keyword research. 2. Simple user interface Even the least tech savvy self publisher can figure out how to search a broad keyword, filter the list provided and then download the full list in a spreadsheet. 3. Autocomplete service Rather than spending a ton of time on Amazon typing and snapping shots of the latest keywords in the auto-suggest, you can make a quick search and be done. Then, all you have to do is remove whatever keywords that don't fit your needs. The cons of the Keyword Tool Dominator include 1. No category selection Even though you can choose a specific Amazon region, you aren't able to select a specific category. This means that the tool will bring back more results than just Kindle or print books. Two, too many keywords. Oftentimes the KTD extension will bring back hundreds of keywords, leaving you to sift through a bunch of unnecessary and irrelevant keywords for publishing. This goes back to my previous point that the KTD tool needs to have Amazon category selection to bring more value to the publishing community. Three, no stoppage. As soon as you fire off a search, you have to wait for it to complete before you start another search. Whether you typed in the wrong spelling or find few immediate search results based on your search, you're forced to wait till KTD is done. 
Though it's a minor inconvenience, I've often had to refresh my browser so I could start another search. KTD could make life easier by having a simple stop button so I can search for another keyword instead of waiting it out. With all that being said, I give my shining endorsement of the Keyword Dominator tool. Outside of the few small hangups, I still find this an invaluable keyword research tool that saves me time and heartache. If you'd like to check out the Keyword Tool Dominator, then head over to KeywordToolDominator.com. And if you enjoyed today's content, then share it with at least one other person who's into DIY publishing too. Till later, this has been Self Publishing with Dale, and I'll see you guys soon.